please subscribe to boost up station because i always give you quality content so here we have the problem unknown file system entering grub rescue mode grub rescue okay or you can also see that no such partition all right so we are going to fix this problem so first of all you need to boot into a live usb of the same linux operating system you have installed in your machine okay if you don't have one live usb then you can watch the below video in the description to create one all right and after that you have to launch the terminal from the live usb and you have to run these commands one by one okay so if you run the first command here you will be able to get the uuids of all of the partitions you have in your linux machine or let's say the machine itself okay so you have to find the root partition first of all so you can see its type is ext4 and the partition is dev slash sdb4 right so we are going to mount this partition into the directory mnt okay i have already placed the partition here sdb4 your might be different so place it right here from here all right so we are just going to copy this command and paste here and mount it now it has been mounted to this location slash mnt in the live usb now after that if you don't have the efi system then you can just proceed with the next commands otherwise you have to run this command and to get the location of the efi partition here you can see that its type will be mentioned as vfat okay labeled efi okay so the partition i have is dev sdb1 so i'm just going to execute this command here i have dev sdb1 already placed in press enter now you can move ahead so we are just going to mount these dev pts proxies and run partitions execute this command press enter now we are going to ch root into the slash mnt folder okay where we have mounted the ext4 partition which have this problem okay now you have to execute this command to create the configuration grub configuration all right because of which we are getting this problem now it is doing the things here and you can see that it has successfully created the image okay now you just have to install the grub to get this directory you just have to remove this four from this location okay where we had this ext4 partition so we have to keep this location only removing the four so we get this one here drag and drop and execute this command so if you get this type of error efi variables are not supported on this system so to fix this error you just have to watch the video link in the description all right so after fixing this efi variables problem we are just going to execute this command again okay press enter and now you can see that the installation has been finished without any errors okay now if you have just type exit here exit press enter and now you can just type sudo reboot now to reboot the system and you will get your linux operating system entries during the boot okay so please subscribe to boost up station and that's it for now thank you for watching now it's time to discover more simply click on the screen to subscribe to our channel and watch another video to discover more